Hello and welcome. My name is David Isamuje. This is a t-shirt design on Canva. Yeah, I'm the owner and founder of What a T-shirt Design, as you can see. So if you're on my Facebook page for the first time, please I would advise you subscribe. Thanks a lot. Please hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. Without wasting much of your time, I will just go straight to this tutorial on how to design a t-shirt design in Canva. Yes, a t-shirt design in Canva. So let's get right, straight right to it. So I'll just open my Chrome or uh, first visit the site called flat icons flat icons is where I get my design so I'll click on cut uh, search for cuts I'll search for cuts once it's done opening as you can see there are different design this was the one I downloaded earlier i was doing a video but something went wrong with my mic so i had to start the video again but this was the one i downloaded and this is the owner always make sure you give credit please if you use designs from this side please always give credit these guys did a lot of work to get this out so always give them credit thank you so now once you download that the next step is to go to canva.com Canva.com is an online platform to design just in case you don't know about Canva but most of you that clicked on this video definitely want to know how to use Canva so you have the idea already so now you click on create custom dimension standard is 4500 by 5400 pixel you click on create design it's gonna open yeah this is a new Canva a new layer if you're using Photoshop, you call it layer. If you're using Canva, you call it a Canva. So as simple as that. So now we'll come to upload, upload image or video. Come to download. We we'll just find our cuts. This is it. Ready? Downloaded it. I'll just click on it. Open. It's going to load. So now that it's loaded, all I have to do to bring it onto this place is just to click on it. And voila is there so the next step will be to just add our text under we we'll just add our text under so to do that we're gonna bring in the text so I'll come to this text and just find a fancy font Canva has so many fonts to pick from so I'll just find one fancy one I think I like this so if I click on it, see it has appeared here. So I'll just make it bigger. So to make it bigger, all you have to do is to click on one of this edge, press on your left mouse click button, drag inward to reduce, drag outward to increase. As you can see, it's grouped with some other text which I don't want. So all I'm gonna do is ungroup. Then I'll click on each element I don't want and delete. And delete. So now I have just the fonts which I want I'll just the font which I want so I'm gonna I like this and it's going to say it's going to say a and this this is going to say kitty so that's all that's all I want to do with this so now you can see I have the design says hey kitty so now all i'll just do is i'll just try to shift this up a bit to make sure i see in there I'll just, okay then i'll take this hey kitty up a bit and just increase it a little my left mouse key button and drag outwards then i'll just center it here so now if you're using the free canva pro like you see now you can't export with without this white background it's going to export with the white background so if you want canva pro just let me know in the comment i'll send you a one month link you can use canva pro for a month free on me but if you want to use it on just white mugs white t-shirts white canva or anything white then you can you are good to go you can use it this way all you have to do is click on download download again see it's downloading it has downloaded and if we go over if we go over 
should be able to find our design it's over here this is our design a kitty so now the next step would be to transfer it over to our shed but i like to always do something like you know i use i use photoshop well so if i'm using the free version i can go through the stress of opening this in photoshop you can go through the stress if you have the time you can go through the stress doing this in photoshop then bringing in another layer by clicking on this folded paper dot over your mouse here then just come over to this magic word tool and I'll just click on this white and now I can delete this you can see it has deleted so if you notice I still have some white in the letterings as you can see so I'll just click on that too delete click on that delete click on that click on that delete and that delete so now you see my design is now completely backgroundless there's no more white background that's because I know how to use Photoshop and I can go through the stress but if you can't go through the stress I'll just advise you get Canva Pro it's just about $12 a month and you get this background without any also so if you want the link just let me know in the comment and i'll send it to you if you're enjoying this video please leave it drop me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss tomorrow's video i upload video every single day trying my best i've been doing that from the first of january i've only missed some days due to some issues but for the whole of February, i've not missed any day so please if you're enjoying this video please i would advise you subscribe and watch my all that series watch my other series so the next step would be to save this just save this I'll save it as um, picture akt PNG I'll just save it you see saving see saving so once it's done saving the next step will just be for me to come back here come to pictures mock-up um, this is my favorite mock-up I normally use this but in today's video I'm gonna be using a different mock-up I'll use a different mock-up so let me use this so I'll just find I think this is it yeah, this is it as you can see you can get it from freepick.com all you have to do is to go to freepick.com to get this you can get it from freepick.com so now the background will unlock can, let me see if i can change this background picture no so i'll just leave it at that come over here shirt So I just find I just find this design design here so I just click on it so this is the design I don't want that so I'll just delete that then I'll bring in my own design pictures okay okay this is it this is one I want so I'll just bring it into this free space you can see this is it so I'll just reduce it to, to do that control my alter key button shift key button and left mouse key button best pressing those three buttons together I'll just drag my mouse inwards and I'll press enter so now I'll just save and now if I go back to my shirt going to be on my shirt as you can see it says a kitty so I'll just move it a bit and save it again 
if we go back this is a kitty so let me increase it a little so do ctrl c then my normal tree button alter key button shift key button left mouse key button just drag outward enter save again and here you go your design is on the shirt and it's ready it sells well on red bubble red bubble is what i use sells well you can promote this on instagram so cat lovers and you are definitely going to make sales on pinterest too same thing so if you enjoyed this video and you want to watch more please click on the playlist to your right so that you can watch more and please subscribe thank you for watching see you on tomorrow's video have a nice day love you